Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. Now we have been in a situation where we have opened up multiple tabs in our web browser, be it for conducting research on a particular topic or web browsing in general. The multiple open tabs do create a lot of confusion while going back and forth between them constantly. And it is very difficult to find a particular tab which you had opened back a while ago. Now in this video, I'll show you the new Chrome feature which lets you create tab groups and label them using colors so that your workflow remains efficient and systematic. So let's head over to Chrome and see how it's done. Well, I've opened up Chrome. Now let me open up a new tab. Let's say Wikipedia. And let's open up YouTube. Now when you right click on the tab, you don't find an option. This is because you have to enable it first. So we'll head over to settings. Make sure your Chrome is updated to version 81. This is the version which supports this new feature. So once you have updated your Chrome browser, you click over here, type in FLAGS flags, hit enter. And you need to search over here, tab groups. GRO. Yes. And click on the drop down menu. Click on enable. This will ask you to relaunch Chrome. Now, once Chrome relaunches, you'll have this option enabled over here. Now, let's see. Let's go over to Wikipedia. Now you see add to new tab group option. Let's click on this. And I got a small color icon. Click on here. Let's choose red for this. Let's add YouTube. We'll add to an existing color group. Let's say Wikipedia. Now, experiments, let's add a new group with this. Change the color to blue. Now let's open up Google. We'll add this to the, the blue icon and let's add another. Let's open up Play Store and let's open up another website. Let's say Gmail. And let's make another ad group. Change this color to yellow. We'll add Gmail to that existing group we play. So there you go. You have three tab groups created, indicated by colors. And that's how easy it is. Well, not just color labels. You can also create names to this group. Let's say education. Let's add this to the education group. this to the education group now for Facebook and Twitter let's use social media add new group social media and for Netflix and Amazon Prime video let's create a new group let's see this is video this Amazon Prime video to the video group. So there you go. All neatly labeled website. Now let's say you want to remove a label. All you have to do is go over here, right click and remove from group. And that is all you need to do. So I hope you enjoyed this short video and learned something from it. Happy web browsing. Until next time. Bye.